Hello, how, how are, are you? you? I'm very good. So good to see you. Good to see you too. You look fantastic. Thank Let's just you. start you there too. with who are you wearing? <laughs> Tom Ford. Oh, I love Tom it. Tom Ford and my own little like lingerie set in my closet. So. <laughs> I like that you put Thanks. that together. Now, let me also ask the very obvious question. Is this body a result of Kinergy? Because you <laughs> look fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you. You know what? This body is a result of actually giving myself a break mm. during COVID. I really took time to actually do nothing and heal and transform from the inside and just take all the like cortisol and the pushing and everything thing and just relax and then Kinergy of course was that like internal healing and transformation um, which is which is what's so different about Kinergy mm -hmm. obviously it tones the body and everything what regular fitness does but yeah. Kinergy is really all about the emotional health and the mental health and the energetic health so I really felt like I I got healthy on the inside this year. Mm. And yeah. is that like the foundation you would say of Kinergy? Mm -hmm. It's not just about working out, it's about working the inside as yeah, well? Yeah, it I is. Love that. It really is. You know, in the age of, you know, bodybuilding back in the mm -hmm. 60s, we were focused on physical health. Yeah. And then right now, I think we're in the age of mental health. And where I think we're heading is emotional health, it's energetic health, because mm -hmm. the way we the way our energy is really dictates our mindset yeah. and then dictates our way to take action moving forward. Mm -hmm. So if our energy is low, yeah. whew, like nothing feels possible. But when our energy is vibrant and alive and we actually feel connected to who we truly are, yeah. anything is possible. So I need to put down the Red Bull <laughs> and get some Kinergy in my life. It is. I love Energize. this. Kinergize. I love it. Actually, when we were on tour, um, I'm going to name drop right now, with Oprah as our launch. As you should. <laughs> Anytime there's an I Oprah know. mention, I'd wear a t-shirt. <laughs> but that's what she said. She's like, I feel energized. <laughs> and we were like, can we use that? Seriously. <laughs> so. Okay, wait, I have to ask you about that. Just the yeah. fact that you were with Oprah. Mm -hmm. You're getting to do something you're passionate mm -hmm. about, something you created from the ground up, and Oprah got behind it. One of mm -hmm. Oprah's favorite things. Mm -hmm. We'll go ahead and say that. How does that feel to know that you put so much heart and soul into it, and it's become what it has become? Honestly, I mean, I, I think about it today and I'm like, how in the heck did we somehow launch our company on tour with Oprah? But there's also just this like divine um, synergy and synchronicity that happens. Mm -hmm. And it just, the stars aligned in a way that we have, you know, similar missions. We, we want to we put impact into the world where it's it's people focused mm -hmm. you know and I think that there's so much change that can happen when you yeah. when you go inward yeah and you really like you ask yourself hard questions and you're not afraid to like go into pain and and actually heal and yeah. like go through your traumas and then and then come out and have a community to support you and mm -hmm. so just having Oprah's support with Kinergy and then being able to be here with Global Citizen um, I'm, I'm honestly kind of speechless because I don't feel like I created this. I feel like this was, this came through me because of my own stuff that I went through. Mm -hmm. And I just wanted to share how this helped me with people who might not know where to start. Yeah. And that's what Kinergy is about. Beautiful. <laughs> beautiful. Last question I will ask you is, you got this show in LA started. You know, you were on the stage <laughs> first. You got everyone out of their seats. What did it feel like to be on stage and then on stage for such a great mm -hmm. cause? You know, I, I love being on stage. I am a performer, like first and foremost. Um, but to be able to take something where Yes, I get to perform and entertain, but at the same time, it's collective. Mm -hmm. We're not just on stage performing for you, but yeah. we're getting to do this together. Yeah. And when you collaborate and you connect in that way, I feel like, I don't know, I, I, it just that's the most rewarding thing because it's about contribution mm -hmm. and that we got to do this together yeah. instead of just like, look at me, I'm performing. Um, but the idea of being on stage to open this up who knows like we haven't been to concerts in a long time right. are people gonna get up and move like this is not the norm and everybody was on their feet and dancing and feeling great and screaming and having a yeah. good time and again like when you when you can connect to something that you feel then change can happen, yeah. I think, versus just doing it from the head. So That's I amazing. hope that we change, not change, I hope that we evoked emotion in people yeah. to move them to take action. Yeah. So We were back here too. Yes, we were getting yes, it girl. too. <laughs> I love it.
Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.